Hello guys, it's 2009 Ecstasy, and I'm here with my brand new series, A Blast to the Past. Basically, I'm bringing back old games, maybe put some new computer games, but it's all computer gaming. And we're going to come here with one of the classic, most exciting series in the PlayStation 1 franchise. One of the first games to come out on the Sony PlayStation. It was phenomenal. It met players to go into this brand new, exciting world under the name Crash Bandicoot. I'm playing it on the PSXC, I think it's called. And I'm starting off here on a boss. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you some game gameplay. And I'm going to be doing a lot of gameplay videos and playthroughs of certain games. Now I'm not going to do all the Crash Bandicoot playthrough on this. Just because it's worthless to keep doing. But I will... There you go. And there you go. There's uh, I just defeated Papu Papu. But this game basically is an adventure game. And it's very old. This game uh, came out around the PlayStation 1 time. So. And it features a lot of weird gameplay. As you are a bandicoot, which is an animal. Is there such thing as a bandicoot? Hmm, never checked that. But anyways, and you're in this immense world, and it's the main character's name is, while well, the main villain's name is Cortex. And you need to get Cortex. He's a really bad guy, I guess, and he hates the bandicoot, which his name is Crash. He's kind of crazy and stuff. And this character is really loving. I mean, not loving, but it's, it's easy to love. You cannot hate Crash. It's an amazing character, and they could really do something good with that. So there you go. I just got to get a Humanaga to get a double Humanaga. Oh, almost died there. So what, what I'm going to do here is I'm not going to spin any of the boxes. So I'm just going to... Oh, shit. Is that going to kill me? Oh, wow. We got some gameplay issues here. Don't know what's going on here. Sorry. Had gameplay issues. Sorry about that, guys. Some freeze. But anyways, this character is easy to love. Is he's addicting. His the way they made him. He's really funny. He's kind of a crazy, stupid type character, and he's just fun. He's just fun to play, and the story is actually quite decent. Now in this game, they feature bosses, and they change all the time. So I'm not gonna fight that easy boss the whole time. But the bosses are relatively easy. I mean, if you play this game enough, the bosses are going to get easy. And the real challenge comes when you got to get the gems. Now, a lot of... Wow, you see that? That was bullcrap right there. Now, a lot of people do 100% playthroughs, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to show you some uh, Crash, and I'm going to be showing you my new series. And I might as well start it off with one of my favorite games of all time for the PlayStation 1. And one of my favorite classic adventure games. But the best adventure game for the old consoles is gotta be Donkey Kong 64, Super Mario 64. Those games were phenomenal, phenomenally, phenomenally made. And then this is one of the one is this is one of the good PS1 games. Now, the PS1. You all should know because if you don't know the PS1, you have problems. But the PS1 is made by Sony. Well, most of you should know that. And it kicked off their brand new um, PlayStation franchise, which is still around today and is still amazing. So, right here is a bonus world. And you basically just collect lives and stuff. It's a free level so you can get good stuff. But I screwed up. But it doesn't matter. I'm not too good. I'm not like an expert crash player. I'm just like the average gamer back then. So, But I am a good gamer. Don't get me wrong. I mean, I play amazing games. But I'm really trying to get away from the Xbox and stuff. And I want to make video game like uh, 